look forward to a wonderful movie, I think. Uh, it was a great experience for me, and I had a great time doing it. We have a fantastic uh, cast. Um, we have the, the skill and the wit and the um, ambition of J.J. Uh, of J. Abrams. Great script by um, uh, one of our original screenwriters, Larry Kasdan. And I was delighted to be involved, and I'm proud to be able to represent uh, this film for the audience. It's too late for them. <laughs> I mean, it's it's over. Uh, life as they knew it is uh, is no longer possible. It's a uh, it's a you know you've you've checked in for the for the biggest e-ticket ride. Uh, there ever was, and uh, I actually did have uh, a bit of a serious um, conversation with Daisy, who who inquired about what the experience was like for me um, some centuries ago when uh, when this all started, and I. You know, I said, your life will change, and you uh, will get used to it, and you will be, um, by turns, uh, happy and delighted and employed, and then you'll wonder what the hell happened uh, every once in a while, because you, you turn from uh, the natural state of an actor is to observe life around them, and... Um, now you have to figure out how to do that when all anybody's looking at is you. Um, so it's a it's going to be it's a huge uh, change in your life, and I, I, you know, they're smart enough to know that themselves. Well, Star Wars and Comic Con sort of go hand in hand. Uh, Star Wars was at the very beginning of Comic-Con, and so uh, it was obviously a, a natural fit to be here, and we're just so excited to talk to the fans and uh, show them some surprises we got in store. Certainly there, you know, on a movie like this, there's always gonna be a ton of visual effects and green screen and the like, but the, the key for all of us was to make a movie that felt authentic, and it's almost impossible to make something that feels authentic if it, if it isn't. And so, um, despite all the visual effects that are undoubtedly going to uh, be all over the movie, the, the, the amount of builds that we, we were able to do, the construction of not just sets, but, but other uh, but characters, and, and uh, the, the props and things that might otherwise be done in post, uh, it allowed the actors to actually physically be there on locations with actual structures and, and uh, creatures that they could interact with. And it, it just, it gave the whole thing a, uh, the, it took something that could be a real effort to sort of make something look real, and it made that part effortless. And then we could concentrate on other things that were more important, like, you know, making the story good and, and the, the characters as strong as they could be. Every stage of the process is sort of a, a thrill, especially on a Star Wars movie, nothing about it is normal. Um, so the idea that you're prepping you know, a Star Wars movie. It's like you're prepping a Star Wars movie. You know, when you're shooting it, you're shooting a Star Wars movie. You know, doing interviews about the Star Wars. I and mean, nothing is normal. Uh, so every, every stage of it feels uh, about as surreal as you can imagine.